2018 has been a very impressive year for the Indian film industry. But on one hand, we have seen multiple films do exceedingly well in the box office as well as garner critical acclaim. There has genuinely been good content that is being presented every month of this year. From great stories to compelling performances, 2018 has been an excellent report card. However, there have undoubtedly been films that have not been seen by many people in the country. And showcasing you exactly those gems that were not witnessed by the masses, here is Tried and Refused Productions, with 7 underappreciated Bollywood movies you already missed in 2018. Bioscope Wala. Sadly, a movie that many people didn't even know about came and just vanished was the Danny Din Zongpa star Bioscope Wala. Directed by Dev Maidkar, the film is an adaptation of Rabindranath Tagore's short story Kabuli Wala. Rather than simply recreating the short story, this adaptation of Kabuli Wala is set somewhere around 1980 during the Taliban regime in Kabul, Afghanistan. The film showcases Rehmat as a man who goes around showing children films through his bioscope, rather than being a dry fruit seller like the original story. Danny Din Zongpa literally seems like he hasn't aged a single year and puts forth an endearing and effortless performance in a storyline that is perfectly craft which creates such a delightful movie going experience for viewers. It's sad that such films which are absolute gems are seen by such a small portion of the population. Mukka Baz. The film directed by Anurag Kashyap focusing on a dedicated boxer marred by conflict from local political goons headed by the menacing Jimmy Shergill. Every actor including Shergill, Vineet and Ravi Kishan put forth great performances in a storyline which is not spectacular but is undoubtedly a good effort. The movie is an unapologetic representation on the condition of sports in the country and the many hurdles in the form of corruption, bureaucracy, red tape and sheer hooliganism that an individual has to face in his or her journey to greatness. A movie that barely made any form of revenue is definitely worth a watch, especially for its performances. Beyond the Clouds Majid Majidi is one of the most talented and celebrated directors in the world, especially known in praise for his 1997 film Children of Heaven. Movie buffs were privileged enough to witness the director create Beyond the Clouds in 2018 which starred Ishan Khattar and Malvika Mohanan, a movie that focuses on a sibling relationship and the bond that is put to the test when the girl is put into jail for a crime that the brother has committed. The movie which focuses on many aspects including poverty, the unjust police system and the division of society into haves and have nots really creates a captivating storyline and premise. With some commendable performances by the star cast and a gruesome yet truthful portrayal of characters under dire circumstances, Beyond the Clouds does not fail to disappoint. Union Leader A movie that literally no one knows about that released in 2018 was the Sanjay Patel-directed film Union Leader. The movie focuses on the trials and tribulations of Jay, played beautifully by Rahul Bhatt, a worker in a poorly managed chemical plant and his struggle and want to escape from this life for a better future for his family, primarily focusing on the strength of the labor union and standing up against unjust practices by the people in power, Rahul Bhatt and the supporting cast literally grasp your attention in every frame. A movie that showcases the sad and ugly truth of the condition of the labor force and people struggling to make ends meet. We highly recommend this thought-provoking film. October. Shujit Sarkar is definitely one of the most talented directors in the country today. And when he collaborated with Varun Dhawan to create October, we were ready for whatever the duo had to offer. The film focusing on hotel management trainees, the unfortunate accident of one of their colleagues, and the undefined, complex, yet extremely strong and real connection one person has with an individual is presented in such a subtle yet effective manner. Varun Dhawan's performance is truly effortless, sharing such memorable moments with all the supporting characters. A movie with a simple but tragic story that truly grasps all your attention. Blackmail, a film that truly baffled my mind when we looked at the box office report, was the Irfan Khan star and hilarious comedy titled Blackmail. Directed by Delhi Belly director Abhinay Deo, the film only managed to make 28 crores at the box office, and we believed it deserved so much more attention. A demotivated and disinterested individual, professionally and personally, finds out that his wife is cheating with a deadbeat, good for nothing individual. And rather than confrontation, the individual, in order to pay off certain debts, blackmails him. This leads to a series of confusing events and multiple characters joining in the blackmail to get their own piece of the pie. Wickedly hilarious and dark, the film offers some great performances and truly a crazy but enjoyable movie-going experience. 
Omerta. If actor Rajkumar Rao had not already impressed us in 2017, he came with a stellar performance even this year in the Hansel Mehta film Omerta. The actor portrayed the role of Omar Sheikh, a recounting of the story of the infamous British born terrorist Ahmed Omar Said Sheikh, who kidnapped and murdered Wall Street Journal reporter Daniel Pearl in 2002. Omerta is an Italian word which means a code of silence maintained by mafia against disclosing information to the police and also not interfering with the activities of other groups. The movie that takes us through the haunting journey of an educated individual who leaves every comfort and luxury and transforms into an Islamic fundamentalist is scary to witness. Rajkumar Rao's smug smile, overpowering stare, and sheer unaffected belief in radical Islam set around Hansel Mehta's style of storytelling creates a package which I highly recommend for you to watch. And that was the list guys. Write it down in the comments below if you have some video ideas for our channel. Please don't forget to follow me on Instagram. The handle's right in front of you. Follow me at jammypants4. Also please support us by smashing the like button and subscribing to our channel for weekly content ahead. Thank you for watching.